Alfresco is an open source platform for business critical document management and collaboration. Going by its vast number of downloads, strong global partner channel and a stellar client list, Alfresco makes a strong case for itself as a competent ECM tool. Alfresco allows you to manage your documents behind the firewall, in the cloud and even on your mobile devices. Alfresco provides an easy to use standard driven solution that enables effective document, web and record management. Integration with social publishing is also provided and allows integration with Twitter, YouTube, Flickr, SlideShare, etc. Alfresco content platform allows organizations to fully manage any type of content from simple office documents to scanned images, photographs, engineering drawings and even large video files. Alfresco's built-in workflow allows companies to automate document intensive business processes thereby saving them time and money. Alfresco integrates with MS Office, Apple iWork, Adobe Creative Suite, Google Docs and more. You can build content-rich applications and websites using RESTful APIs or Java and open standards like CMIS and JSR 168. Alfresco applications are built on the content application server and rely on the server to persist, access, query and manage content. Alfresco Explorer is the original application built with the Alfresco system to manage content. Explorer lets you browse the repository, set up rules and actions and manage content and its metadata associations and classifications. Alfresco Share is a next generation user interface built entirely with the Alfresco web script technology and can be used to extend application. Share provides content management capabilities with simple user interfaces, tools to search and browse the repository, thumbnails and associated metadata, previews using flash renditions of the content and collaboration tools like wikis, discussions and blogs. Several ECM applications can use Alfresco as a foundation. Applying programming models lets you extend standard Alfresco feature set and you can build your own applications using Alfresco. You can create knowledge and document management systems. You can replace your shared drive with Alfresco using its CIFS protocol. Enterprise portals, intranets, web content and record management systems can be implemented with Alfresco. Information publishing can involve digital assets like articles written internally or syndicated from other sources or photographs. Media companies use Alfresco to combine this content and publish it to their websites. Case management handles information related to a case like an insurance claim, an investigation or personnel processing. Alfresco incorporates the activity workflow engine and can handle sophisticated workflows and queue management. Alfresco gives you different download options to choose from as per your requirement. Please note we have downloaded and used the enterprise edition of Alfresco for this video tutorial. So now that you have an overview of Alfresco and assuming that you have downloaded the enterprise edition on your local machine, let's look at the system path where the Alfresco would run. Alfresco works on both Windows and Linux operating system machines. The class path root denotes a directory whose content are automatically added to the start of your application server's class path. The location of this directory varies depending on your application server as shown here. A number of programming models are available for building an application using the Alfresco content application server. Using the out-of-the-box components of Alfresco share is the simplest way. You can define rules and actions using a wizard and perform related content actions. To build new user interfaces or extensions to Alfresco share, you can use web scripts by using web templating language like FreeMarker. Most of the Alfresco share was built using web scripts. Surf, the web runtime framework, lets you extend Alfresco share and build web applications. The last one is Content Management Interoperability Services, the OASIS standard for accessing content repositories to write applications that use Alfresco but are portable to other ECM systems. Alfresco is a product that has been designed to support modern ECM requirements based on the principles that are relevant today. Alfresco is simple and horizontally scalable. This makes Alfresco good to have in growing enterprises. Its modular approach allows fine tuning and optimization of an ECM solution. Alfresco incorporates best of breed libraries and is environment independent. Alfresco is less about the application and more about the services embedded within an application. You can choose how to package Alfresco, for example, as a web application, an embedded library, or even as a portlet. Alfresco has a solid core, scriptable extensions, and follows a standards based approach. Primary concerns addressed by Alfresco are reducing vendor lock in, improving integration possibilities, and hook into the ecosystem built around the chosen standards. There are many ways to slice and deploy Alfresco. However, most deployments follow a general pattern. Solutions commonly offer multiple clients against a shared server where each client is tailored for the environment in which it is used. Alfresco offers two primary web-based clients, Alfresco Explorer and Alfresco Share. 
The Alfresco Content Application Server comprises a content repository and value-added services for content control and collaboration. The two standards that define the content repository are CMIS and JCR. These standards provide a specification for content definition and storage, content retrieval, versioning and permissions. The Alfresco Content Application Server exposes two types of interfaces, APIs and protocol bindings for allowing the clients to communicate with it. These remote public interfaces are the only part of the server that are visible to the client. To access the Alfresco out-of-the-box services and to extend them, the Alfresco Content Application Server exposes two flavors of APIs, remote and embedded, each designed for a specific type of clients. The remote API is primarily used to build ECM solutions against the Alfresco Content Application Server. It further has two flavors. The Web Services API has tools for building the content bindings covering all of the most common environments and programming languages. The Web Services API also lends itself to orchestration through third-party business process engines, allowing the integration of content services into a wider business process. The RESTful API is more recent and its scope has been expanding to cover all services of Alfresco Content Application Server. Behind the scenes, Alfresco embeds the Spring Web Scripts for developing its RESTful API. It is good to know that the web services and RESTful APIs, although comprehensive, are proprietary APIs. A client implementing these APIs can only execute against Alfresco, therefore locking out content that may reside in a content repository of another vendor. The embedded API comes in several forms, where each form is structured for a particular need or kind of extension. It may be for a business process definition, content models, or even interfaces for interacting with the content repository. An application or a client can also directly embed the Alfresco Content Application Server to inherit its suite of content services. The content repository is built on this infrastructure, which itself is a building block for content control and collaboration services. Each capability of the content repository and the content services is individually bundled as a module with its own in-process interface and implementation. You can deploy extensions to the Content Application Server to extend and override its capabilities. Their implementation may use the in-process interfaces offered by the content repository and content services. The content repository is comparable to a database except that it holds more than data. The binary stream of content are stored in the repository and the associated full text indexes are maintained in the Lucene indexes. The query engine and the storage engines are hooked into the transaction and permission support of the infrastructure, offering consistent views and permission access. Several query languages are exposed. Alfresco Share and the all-new Alfresco web applications are built on Spring Surf. At the heart of the Spring Surf is a site assembly framework which bundles a full site construction object model and a toolkit for building websites and applications. Spring Surf works on Alfresco web content management and provides virtualized content retrieval, preview and test support for user sandboxes and web projects. Applications built with Spring Surf can be deployed from Alfresco web project spaces to production servers. This means that Alfresco services such as change sets, preview and deployment can manage Spring Surf sites. In addition, an embedded API supports programmatic control of the same artifacts as shown here. The Alfresco Content Application Server supports many folder and document-based protocols to access and manage content held within the content repository using familiar client tools. All the protocol bindings expose folders and documents held in the Alfresco Content Repository. Most protocols also permit updates, allowing a client tool to modify the folder structure, create and update documents and write content. Some protocols also allow interactions with capabilities such as version history, search and tasks. Internally, the protocol bindings interact with the content repository services which encapsulate the behavior of, the, of working with files and folders. This ensures a consistent view and update approach across all client tools interacting with the Alfresco content application server. An Alfresco subsystem for file servers allows configuration and lifecycle management for each of the protocols, either through property files or JMX. The supported protocols include Common Internet File System, which allows the projection of Alfresco as a native shared file drive. Web DAV and FTP are also supported. Alfresco presents itself as a mail server, allowing clients like Microsoft Outlook, Apple Mail, and Thunderbird to connect and to interact with folders and files held within the Alfresco content repository. IMAP is a prevalent standard for allowing email access on a remote mail server. Microsoft SharePoint protocol enables Alfresco to act as a SharePoint server, creating tight integration with the Microsoft Office suite. 
very relevant in the context of most organizations today. This ends our section of providing an Alfresco overview and a detail of its fundamental capabilities. In the next section, we shall cover getting started with and configuring Alfresco.